discipline. I've been studying high performance for several years now. Why is it that some teams outperform other teams on an ongoing basis? Even if the talent isn't as high, and you can talk from sports, business, and many, many other elements. And the resounding element is the huge value of an effective coach and manager. If you even have a look at the, and many of your viewers might not know, the Springbok rugby team, mm. have a look at the difference that Rusty Erasmus here as our head coach made and manager when he came in before the World Cup and the um, horrendous run of results before that. Similar players, nothing changed. And what we've certainly invested a huge amount of effort and what we see have the biggest impact on sales team's results is the ability of an effective manager or leadership structure to put in place a process, not just per team, but per individual to create a framework for that individual for success. And there's quite interesting information around that. But in my opinion, if I want to look at the results of an organization's sales teams, I'm going to look at the sales leader and sales manager and investigate what have they structured per individual to give them the best chance of success as well. Hmm. 